Now this is a good way to start the day, you guys. Good sunrise, good workout. I'm breathing in fresh air. It's just putting in freshness through my spirit, soul, mind, and body. Yes, it's gonna be a good day today. There's a bright star shining tonight. Roll up, where's the ball? I Get that ball. Never seen Bring it here. Where's your ball? So we changed the lemonade stand. Now it, it well, we got to take down fish pond, but uh, it says hot cocoa for the winter. Can you believe it's December and there's no snow on the ground? It's all melted. We had an early snow, but it melted away. Bro, you want to come down and play? Lily, where's the ball? So we're outside. This shirt is too warm for me. I'll probably go short sleeve pretty soon. Even though I'm in Minnesota, the great, what's supposed to be the great white north. And it isn't. But playing with the dogs, raking leaves, having a fire. Life is good in Minnesota. Well, it's that time of year again to put up Christmas lights and Christmas right. decorations. And there it is. They're up in the attic. So. Karen has it organized up there so very well that we have to take you YouTubers up here and show you the organization. But she's handing me a snowman, so hold on a second. I love snowmen. I can't. I can't. Like a little hole in the back you can carry it. From. I can't resist. I can't resist putting up a snowman. One of these is for the lake, right? Yeah. Check it out, you Tubalonians. Up in the attic, we have all of our Christmas stuff. Let's go up and take a look. Karen's got it so well organized. She catalogs things up in the attic. So we have our Christmas stuff up here for the outdoor, anyway. <laughs> so there you have it. We are getting ready for Christmas. And it's a gorgeous day outside. Here it's been cold all of October and November, but now it's warm up. <laughs> That's okay with me. I'll take it. Look, Sadie, who's here? <laughs> Did she miss you? Oh, yes. She's knocking you over? Oh my gosh, you're so strong. She's like pure muscle. Yeah, she is. Oh, there you are. I was like, where are you? <laughs> <laughs> where is YouTube? Oh, we are over here. Oh my gosh. You're like... Sadie loves Kate the most. Aww. Even more than me. I mean, she loves you more than she Her loves me. Like Not pink. like she loves you more than I love you. <laughs> How's her teeth? Quite yellow. The growth. No, the growth. Kate growth. is oh, our growth. resident Kate is our resident vet. She the checks. Growth. The, the growth looks alright. Yeah. Oh, there's, looks a... like there's something there. Honestly. Huh? Right there. It looks like a little something-something. Like a foreign object, which might like have caused splinter? it. Like a splinter? So that or might like have caused it all. Maybe. Huh. I gotta here we discover it right here on YouTube. That was so swollen we couldn't see it earlier this year. But it could have been wood at one point and it just splintered. Wood. Yeah, that would be wood. So Kate just dug this out. So that what appeared to be tumorous lumps have shrunk and now they shrunk enough that Kate was able to get in and find that fiber that you saw. Whether it was a wood chunk or and now that that's out. glass or something, who knows. Yeah, it could be wood splinters, it could be anything. Splintered tooth, I don't know. Not but splintered tooth. No, it was softer than that. Because it was like poked in there. It looked like. It wasn't like hanging down, it was like straight in. It looked so like whale it, teeth. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, what do Say he's eating krill behind our back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Something like that. So, so no, the, the swelling has gone down. It's taken three months for the swelling to go down enough that now you could see the tip of that. Yeah. And you went in today and pulled it out. With the tweezers. And, and now we're going to see if those lumps and swelling continue to reduce. But mm -hmm. everything's been reducing for three months very slowly. Mm -hmm. And this increases my hopes even more. Yeah, that, and she's not on those antibiotics anymore either. No, and I think her body just reacted to the foreign object in there so bad mm -hmm. that it looked like a tumor, but it's been reducing yeah. with care that we've been giving her. Mm -hmm. 
for the like last three months to the point where now you can see what was in there that was yeah. causing the whole problem in the first place. Mm -hmm. So it's unknown what it was, but we're thinking that the chance of tumor is very minimal. So this is super, super good yeah. news. Yeah. I am a very happy guy. Right now. <laughs> I could just feel like the sun is on me. Well, well. it is. <laughs> I'm happy. <laughs> we're both very happy. Oh, she needs a good brushing, but I oh lost all of her brushes. Oh my gosh. Well, you know Look what? at you. <laughs> you are now a yellow lab. Oh gosh. Yellow lab shirt. Uh, look her all. Oh my gosh, look at that. Let's him. see what <laughs> exists <laughs> in Kate's car. Hmm. Toys. Any presents for me? For Christmas. Oh, Rolo. You can have some PB Hi. Hi, Rolo. Did you have a little diarrhea? Is he, is he? He's better. He's better? good, yeah. Okay. Look at that, you got dog implements right there in your truck. I'm putting up Christmas lights because it's a beautiful day. Hey, come here. Oh, she's like, I don't like you anymore. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'll just leave. <laughs> See, Sadie, that's not so bad. You she you hates double? being brushed, groomed, and inspected. Inspector cake. Did you bring all the baseballs? Because we have lots of baseballs in our yard. No. Maybe it hailed baseball size. Maybe. Hail. <laughs> it didn't melt. Oh, aren't I funny? You're funny. Oh no, no, what the heck? What? What is that? Rust? That is rust. Terrible. Looks like your car's been shot. Gah. Come on, mister. Hi. Oh, don't pee on my feet now. Go potty rolling. Come on, go You've potty. Been at me for too long. Good potty. Good boy. Not on the electrical cord. That would be shocking. Go potty, Rolo. Hurry Come on. Good morning, YouTube audience. I'm marveling at how Coho is watching my shadow. <laughs> you make shadow puppets. <laughs> what is that, Coho? <laughs> It's a banana. You want to eat a banana? <laughs> mm. <laughs> Look, it's a moose. Hold this. It's half a moose. It's a moose. Moose. <laughs> <laughs> it's a reindeer. <laughs> What's going on, Coho? What is that? That's kind of a cool picture. I'm going to take a picture of that. Look at what one of my favorite activities has always been ever since I was a kid. And that is to plug in the Christmas lights and see if they work. Change the bulbs. These cool bright lights, though, aren't exactly cool. They're kind of hot to the touch. Look, Kate! It's that Christmas time of year. Night. We're gonna. I love putting these on the house. These big ones, the sea bulbs or whatever they call them. Sadie, come here, and you shall be adorned in Christmas lights. Look, Sadie, Christmas lights. Do you like them? Don't chew on them. Here, let's let's decorate you. There, you're the Christmas puppy. <laughs> She's chewing on a bone, not on Christmas lights. Yeah. <laughs> Here, we need to distribute those better. There you go. That's a good girl. And they're not super hot, so I'm being careful. Oh, yeah, let's not heavy chew on that one. Anyway, they're not super hot. They're just kind of hot. Warm to the touch. Good girl. You like your Christmas lights, Sadie? <laughs> Stay. Hey, Kate. This tree graduates this year. It always had green lights, cause it, little green lights, because it was always a little tree. But this year, it grew to be huge. So yeah. it gets to have, it gets to have these new lights, these, uh, these new bigger ones that I like. So my little tree is growing up. <laughs> In the garbage, I found bubbles. This is, this makes lots of bubbles when it's windy. And today, it is windy. And we got a dog who likes to chase things. 
Okay, we got a fun puppy and we got a tube of bubbles. Even though it's only like 17 degrees out, we're gonna play bubbles. Here, Rollo, come and get him. Look, look what I got. No, you can't tip it over. Are you ready? You ready to get bubbles? There you go. Get the bubbles, Rollo! <laughs> Good boy! Here comes some more. Ready? Get the bubbles! <laughs> Get them, Rollo! Get them! Where'd the bubbles go? Who wants to chase a ball? You ready? Here it comes. Here it comes. Get it! <laughs> Who got it? Rollo got it. This is very interesting. When I throw the ball, Lily can sprint faster than Rollo. But on the rebound, Rolo can get back here a lot faster. So Lily always sprints to catch it. Lily always gets there first. Lily's faster on the sprint than Rolo. But on the long term, Rolo's still running faster than Lily on the rebound coming back. Watch this. Now switch hands here. Okay, you guys, you ready? Here it comes. Get it! Look at Lily go. She is fast. Now she's got the ball. Come on, Rollo! And the Rollo always gets back here first, and Lily slows down. So on the longer run, I don't know my running terms, but on the longer run, on maybe the marathon, Rollo is the faster on the longer. But on the sprint, Lily's the winner. Get it! Look at her go. <laughs> Rollo, come! Still no sign of Mason. Well, there's lots of signs of Mason at night. He's around here a lot. So I'm putting out food, trying to make him know that he's always welcome to be coming back in the yard. Mason's favorite places to be is up on the deck when I'm in bed. He won't come up there during the day. I'll sit out here and quietly call for him and not have the dogs around. Co uh, Mason only comes out at night. And he comes out a lot. So we're also making sure he can get into the heated dog house to stay warm. Go get it! <laughs> Look at that run. That is a good sprint. Get a Rollo! It's left! Oh, almost had it. Come on, Rollo! Come on! Here, puppy! Rollo just likes to run along just for the exercise. <laughs> well, fun. We just got a blizzard warning for tomorrow issued. And so we are... Uh, we are cleaning up the yard. We're putting everything away. We've cleaned up our leaf piles and all the wood that was sitting in the fire pile. And uh, we're getting ready for the yard to get buried by a blizzard. 50 mile an hour winds, they say. I have a lonely croc shoe sitting out on the deck. I wonder who may have brought that over there. <laughs> do, you, do you know anything about my shoe, Rolo? No? I didn't think so. It must have been the owl. Is he out there? There it is, you Tubalonians, the finished product. I put in more decorations this year than I usually do. And my favorite is are those cool bright lights that I put around the door frame. Well, around the whole front porch. Do you guys like it? Does it look good? Ha, <laughs> I see a cat sitting on the couch. See him up there? Yeah, I think this is gonna look good when it snows. We got a blizzard coming tomorrow. And I'm projecting the sign that says let it snow. You can't really see it because it's not dark yet, but I'll show you what it looks like tomorrow once the snow falls. But my sign says let it snow, so let the blizzard come. This looks nice. I'm very happy with it. And of course we have to have a snowman. We got this at a thrift store this summer. Or a garage sale actually. Isn't he cute? Okay, it's getting dark, but Rolo's ready to play. And I'm gonna throw him the dot. There's the dot, get it. <laughs> this is a great way he loves this exercise. He just runs, he knows he can't catch it. He's smart enough to know it as not for real. But he likes like the the impetus to run, the reason to run. Get it, Rollo, get it. 
Yes, Rollo loves to run. Just being that he can't swim this time of year because it's too cold and the lake is frozen solid, well, Rollo needs another activity. And so we say, get the dot. Good boy. I've been doing this for a good 10 minutes and he's very much appreciating the extra exercise. There you go. Good boy. Good boy. Um, I thought I'd give you a quick update on Mason. I know everyone is very concerned about Mason, as I am too. Mason wants to be outside. He wants to be left alone, apparently. But he also is hanging around a lot. And uh, I, I just I long for the day where I can pet him and hold him again and uh, take care of his vet needs, although he has no, he's up on all of his shots right now. So that's a quick update on Mason. I'm very encouraged that he is hanging around, he is getting food and water, and he is getting warmth. So he wants to live outdoors. Um, like someone said, you can never own a cat. A cat owns me. He owns my heart. And uh, he's hanging around. So I'm very encouraged by this. So come out and take a Christmas stroll with me Okay, the moon is out. Kind of see it behind the trees. See it up there? And the Christmas lights are on. The sun is setting. It's a beautiful evening. Beautiful sunset with a beautiful tree and a beautiful sound of a train horn. <laughs>